In our first video, we'll cover the basics of ad serving with all the perks. We'll get you familiarized with all the fancy words like DSPs, click tags, dynamic text, and so on. By the end of this video, you'll be fluent in advertising. Let's begin by covering what is ad serving in the first place. Ad serving allows you to generate an optimized HTML script called ad tag. It is tailored for specific ad networks and by design it withstands high volumes of traffic. Now what's actually in it for you? What are the benefits of using it? I thought you'll never ask. You may be familiar with the error messages from your DSP that the file size is too big. You can say goodbye to all size limitations since the designs are served on our side. This way, you can even use video assets, which was unthinkable before. At the same time, with live updates, you make changes with the press of a button instead of re-uploading the designs every time. This way, you can say goodbye to files that look like this. I bet you won't miss them. Now that you can make an educated guess if you need ad serving in your professional life, let me show you how to start using it. This can be done by going to subscription under manage account or from the editor by simply clicking the ad serving button. Customize your ad serving plan with ad delivery and optimization by selecting how many impressions you need to use on a monthly basis. You can always adjust and change the exact numbers if needed, based on your estimated campaign volume. Alright, moving forward, we're gonna walk through everything that the ad serving add-on has to offer. We are greeted with several options, starting with the most important. Use click tag, which gives you the ability to add a URL and make the whole ad creative clickable. Keep in mind that the already existing go to URL actions won't be overwritten by it. Below it, we have the responsive scaling that will automatically scale your design while keeping the same aspect ratio no matter the screen or ad placement size. Next, there is the dynamic text. Use this to customize your ads by setting up variables and linking a CSV feed. We dedicated a whole video on how to personalize your ad creatives with this feature. With external tracking, you can set up additional tracking pixels to get insights such as impressions and clicks. Please keep in mind that some DSPs might have restrictions for tracking pixels, so make sure you look into that. Last but not least, under Ad Network you have a list of custom tailored codes that ensure full compatibility with the Ad Network. Note, we also give the ability to create custom templates for your Ad Networks of choice, in case you can find them in our list. Just go to Ad Delivery, Ad Networks, Custom Ad Network and add the click tag macro code. Going back to the editor, you can start using it by copying the code and download it as a CSV or Excel file. Now that you're ad serving fluent, you're ready for the next creative stop as we're exploring the possibilities of dynamic text. We'll cover everything you need to know about geolocation, translation and variables to keep your ads personalized. 